They've studied Notre Dame's protection all offseason, trying to figure out ways to be able to try to get it. Bolson, a third down catch, fights for first down yardage. Another first down throw. This is Robinson again, gets a couple blocks on the edge, and the rangy guy gets 10 yards. So Chauncey Sism replacing Eskridge at the corner position. Again, Robinson active, fourth catch already, about an eight yard gain on that play. He'll have to run. Olson in the pocket fires near side catch made by pro size another first down as he beat the linebacker Dyshawn Davis one turnover the entire year. First and 15 throw near side on a very short game that's been quick the senior tight end Kroom knocked that ball loose. On second and nine throw far side catch made Robinson. They find it something that works, and Kelly just take it with it. It's another first down. Yeah, and, and it's Bentley moves the ball to the 23. Fuller in motion now. And gets the ball in the flat. Syracuse. Can't get him. Will Fuller scooting to the end zone. Touchdown. Irish score first. Cam McDaniel is the back as Golson finally does take a shot downfield. Fuller collects the ball at the 20 and finds the end zone for a second time. 72 yards they beat Corey Winfield. Right. Thank you Bear. All right. Look good Bear. in prime time down he does. there. Yeah. First down throw they throw it to Procise in traffic. And second down after the timeout they flip it far side. Chris Brown short gain it'll set up third and short. Eskridge who thankfully is on second and 11. Syracuse brings pressure again. Golson gets it away far side. It's Robinson with yet another catch. Olson fires near side long throw for makes the catch drop in bounds. You do wind the clock. Olson fires far side high throw catch by Chris Brown. That'll stop the clock as they move the chains to the 15 yard line. Syracuse shows pressure then backs off. Here's a completion of Fuller trying to fight free across midfield first down. And a couple mistakes. He's, he's been doing a pretty good job. 15 in a row. This is Brown makes another first down. And then if, if you take that again, you take that aspect of it away, then they can run the football up to the middle of the defense. Olson first down throw over the middle, wide open. Diving is Brown has got the ball out in a hurry. Another first down throw, another catch. Folston breaking free. Torian Folston inside the 10. It's first and goal before Eskridge stopped him. Second and goal. It's McDaniel in for Folston to the right of the quarterback. They fake it to him. Golson lobs it to the end zone. A battle for the football. Robinson catches it in the end zone. Touchdown signaled. Syracuse rushes for Golson has time fires far side complete yet another catch by Robinson who's out near the 45 before Wiggins stopped him. And first down Golson looks left another completion Koyak a short gain as you get out of the field to Heather and they have four tonight. Golson 21st consecutive completion to Koyak the tight end near the marker but again this week getting ready for Stanford. Golson flips it short. Catch made. McDaniel jumps over a tackle, is knocked down at the 30 yard line. Golson, a first down throw, far side again. Completion again to Chris Brown. Brown breaking free, dives down near the 20, and now the quarterback Golson within three completions of 26 in a row, tying the FPS record. Committing down into the box, and he gets his, fires the ball back out again. Flips it short. McDaniel makes it 24 completions in a row. Very short game. As a Notre Dame fighting Irish. Got six yards and second and four. Throw near the end zone. Caught for a touchdown by Hunter. And the fourth touchdown for Everett Golson tonight. Two within the record for consecutive completions.